A Guide to Snowboard, brought to you by Toyota. Five categories of snowboard events feature on the Olympic program, three of which are judged, while two are based purely on speed. In slope style, riders go down a course that includes various obstacles, such as rails, boxes and jumps. Some judges focus on the tricks performed in particular sections, evaluating their difficulty and execution while other judges evaluate the run as a whole for its variety and progression. In the final, only the highest scoring run of three counts. In big air, riders travel down a long ramp, then kick into the air to attain maximum height and distance, while performing a single trick before securing a clean landing. In the final, the best two of three scores are added together to determine the final result. In halfpipe, Riders perform acrobatic flips, spins and other airs as they go down a sloped half-cylinder of snow. Riders are judged on the variety, difficulty, style and execution of their run, including the height, form in the air and landings of their jumps and landings of their tricks. In the final, the highest scoring run of three counts. In parallel giant slalom, two riders race simultaneously down parallel courses. The direct knockout format starts with the eighth finals, with the winner of each head-to-head -head matchup moving on to the next round, until there are two left to compete for gold and silver in the big final. In snowboard cross, riders race over a course featuring a variety of terrain, including jumps, berms and rollers. From heats of four riders, the first two to the finish advance to the next round until only four remain to race in the big final for the medals. In mixed team snowboard cross, teams are composed of one man and one woman. The men race down the course first, and as they cross the finish, the gates at the top open, allowing their women teammates to start. The fastest to the bottom wins.